Hey guys, welcome back to the castle tutorial. This is part four, and today we're going to. Um, well, I may have time to do the interior of this tower, the Xbox version tower, but we're going to focus a lot on the PC version of the tower, which is not that different. Just some changes to this design. Uh, first things first, though. Let's uh, let's begin on this. Let's just build this up first, and then we'll see if we have time to do the interiors. But for right here, first things first, we want to do. Flur, flur, flur. Uh, let's make a, uh, a little floor, just like we did for the other tower. Just fill this entire area with stone bricks or whatever material you want to use for your floor. And it's getting dark. Let me change, change to day only. Okay. Now we will move on to this uh, corners with the tree blocks, and bring these up by two blocks. These little stone brick corner pieces things. You know what I'm talking about. Okay, now that's done. We're going to want to take our cobblestone stairs. Where are they at? Let me grab some cobblestone stairs. Um, I already have that. Uh, and cobblestone wall. We'll need that. Okay, now we're going to put one right here with two uh, stone brick stairs on either side of it. Upside down, yeah, upside down stairs. And then right here, uh, another upside down stone brick stair. And right there as well. Then we're going to put a cobblestone wall right on top of that upside down cobblestone stair. With two stone brick stairs upside down facing away from the block. Or towards it. The I, I, I need to find it. Tell me if I'm talking about it right. If it's facing away or towards, I don't know. Anyway. Put a regular stone brick on top of those with a stone brick slab right in the middle. And then for these, you want to put down an upside down stone brick stair and an upside down stone brick stair with a slab on top. Okay, and then right here you just have a uh, little slab floor. And there you go, there's your uh, crenellation type design on your tower. Okay, and then. Um, like I said, I don't think I want to do this side just yet until we have some stuff in here. But now we'll move on to the uh, second part of the tower. Let me grab a tree block. Okay. And you just want to put two uh, log blocks right here in the corner in that design. Same thing right there, there, and there. And then bring these up eight blocks once again, just like this bottom area. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Bring all of them up. Whoops. Okay, we'll just don't worry about those for right now. <laughs> just skip over that real quick. Okay, now on the inside of these, you just put down some cobblestone, not cobble, the stone brick blocks. Uh, five from the top, so one, two, three, four, five. And you do the same thing all around on the, all the sides. And then for the uh, for this thing, you can put this little arch design on here if you want to, or you can go with the original design, which is a uh, upside down stone brick stair with a stone brick on top of it, and the two upside down stone brick stairs on either side, like that. And then there's uh, two cobblestone walls on top of that with a stone brick stair. In that uh, in that shape. Okay, and you can keep that or do this. Either one is fine. It just has upside down stairs and stuff. So, let me go ahead and finish the other sides of the uh, tower, or this this uh, part of the tower, and I'll be right back with you guys. Okay, so all the sides of the tower are complete, and this is what we have so far. Now, for this part, we're just going to repeat the same thing as this. It's pretty much, this whole area is, this whole part of the tower is pretty much going to be the same. So you're just going to put uh, any block right here in the corners. And replace these two front uh, block blocks with uh, ones that face towards you. Okay, and after you get that done, you're just going to put in buttons on for the fronts of those and I'll just do these few. No reason about doing the others. You can, you can do that. 
not not too crazy. Okay, and we're gonna put a stair right here on top of this stone brick block. And take the oh, actually no leave those in. <laughs> leave those in and then we're gonna bring these up uh by five blocks. This one, two, three, four, five. That side as well, and I just I'll I'll just do all four of these. And it's not uh it's not gonna take too long. And then fill the insides with cobblestone. Oops. Okay. I'm I feel like I'm getting sick. I think I am. <laughs> I'm sneezing. That's not good. Okay, after you get that done, grab a fence and put them on top of all of these log blocks. Okay, now for the top right up here, we're gonna take a uh, stone brick or not a uh, cobblestone stair, put an upside down one right there on the front of that, I believe. One, two, three. Two, three. Yeah. Okay. Now, if you do that, you want to build a top part, and you're just gonna take two log blocks, put them on either s or yeah, either side of this middle one, and then two on top of those. Okay. So you'll you'll do that <laughs> on all four sides. Okay, and then bring these up four blocks high. One, two, three, four. Okay. One more. There we go. Now, we're going to take a uh, stone brick block. I'm going to put one right here with a stone brick stair right there, and I think I did something wrong. <laughs> Damn. Okay. Let me take this up. Let me go check something. I think I did it different. On that, yes, I did. Yeah, okay. I thought we were doing something wrong. So, just move the cobblestone stair uh, one block lower. Instead of the top one, the second to top one. There we go. And then put a stone brick block on top of that. With a upside down stone brick stair on the front. Okay, with a stone brick block on the top of that. And after you get that done, put two upside down stone brick stairs on either side of it. And this is going to be our little crenellation design at the very top of the tower. And just put two uh, stone brick slabs on the top of those upside down stairs. Okay, once you get that done, you want to go in here and replace this top layer of uh, this middle piece of the tower and put in stone bricks. Okay, so you'll have this little layer of uh, stone bricks right here. Then you want to take an oak wood slab. I'm gonna need that. Let me grab. Let me grab some oak wood planks while I'm right here. Cause we'll need that for the roof. But take your oak wood slabs and just put them on the bottoms of these uh, log pillars. Okay. Now we can get started on the roof, and it's the same exact roof as this one. Is um, I'll do it again, just in case. But it's the same exact roof, so you're not doing anything different. Just put a row of oak wood stairs on the front of these sides. And then put oak wood planks in all four of the corners. Okay, so you have this ring of oak wood. Okay, and then put an oak wood plank in the middle of these pillars with one on top of that. And then you're going to take oak wood stairs and put them on top of the logs, like so. And then fill the inside with oak wood planks. And put four in this cross design right around the middle of the tower. Yeah. And then oak wood stairs on top of those, facing towards the middle, with an oak wood plank right on top. Okay. 
And then right here on these corners, put an oak wood slab. Okay. And oak wood slabs along these sides, like so. Once you get that done, you can either put in fences or cobblestone walls right here with an, uh, a stone brick block underneath it and a stone brick slab underneath that. Okay, and that is the tower. That's the finished tower. Yeah. Okay, well, like I said before, you can always uh, mix and match some of these different styles. If you like the arch better than that, you can always just move that over there. It's not going to change anything else. It's, you know, you take off this and replace it with that. Or if you want to use this design on the top, you can do that instead of this design. This is just the original tower. So. Now, I think we have time. I think we have time to do the interior. It's not too much to do. So I'll go ahead and do this one. This is Xbox stuff. It's the same. It's going to be the same exact interior. Nothing's specific for a uh, Xbox version or the PC version. But it's going to make a floor three blocks high. Or four blocks high, rather. Right along here. With a hole right there for a ladder. Let's grab that. Put that down. Come up here. Some crazy shadow shadow stuff going on. And then put a, uh, a layer of stone bricks right on top of that to cover up the cobblestone and log blocks. And we'll bring down we'll bring down this wall right there. So we can put a ladder in. Whoops, that's not a ladder. There we go. And we're at the top. Okay, so we'll go back down here. And I know it's not a lot of room, but you can always put in some chests. Right here, we'll get a torch so we can light this up. I think it's bothering me. There we go. Okay, you can put those right there. Maybe some chests like that. Just store weapons or something, whatever you want to do. Okay, we'll come back down. And we'll take that block off. And bring this... Um, well, actually, take that off and continue the tree block down. Okay. And the ladder as well. And we're going to count three blocks from this floor. That's one, two, three. And put a block on the fourth one and make a little floor. Okay, there we go. And we'll go back down again. It's right here. This should be three blocks. Yes, it is. We'll go ahead and take off the dirt because we don't want that in the bottom of our tower. That's not cool. And replace that with stone bricks or wood or whatever you're using for your floors. Sorry, I forgot to mention that. You know, you can use any material you want. It doesn't really matter. It's, you know, it's just a floor. Okay. So now for the arrow slits, let's take off that and move you right there for now. We're going to take off those, and actually we can't put arrow slits right here. <laughs> uh, actually, we put them right there. Okay. So, the arrow slits, we kind of lied. Um, this would work more on the PC than it would the Xbox, so I'm not sure how you do this on the Xbox version. Uh, at least I'll do the PC right here. Let's put a stair right there and an upside down stair. Yeah, this little arrow slit. And you can put it a little um, layer of slabs so you can come up here and shoot arrows. You can also put it on this side as well. Okay. Now for the Xbox um, crap. <laughs> I totally forgot about these. Oh, man, let's see. 
Could you do that? There's a little hole. Maybe. Hmm. You know what? I really don't know. Oh, man. Well, uh. Maybe I'll come up with something in a bit. But, uh, let's just put the arrow sets on this side as well. You know, in case people get into the castle and you gotta shoot at them. You know, from your tower. You always gotta have arrow slits. Okay. And. Oh, you should be able to fit some right here, I think. Yeah. Nope. Darn. Well, we can put in a door. Right there. You want a door to your tower? You can do that. I don't think you can't put any arrow slits right here. So, yeah, that's pretty much it for the interior. It wasn't much to it. Um, I'm still wondering. We're trying to think about that arrow slit design for the Xbox. But, hmm, damn it. <laughs> You know, I think after the tutorial is over, I might come up with something. And I'll tell you guys in the next episode. I'll be sure to remember that. To figure out something. But yeah, it's the exact same interior for this tower. It's nothing nothing different. You know, just your hole and then... Ladder. Floor. Yeah. I'm not going to do the entire thing. Because I just went through it. But that's that's your towers. That is um damn it. That is the half of the gate. In the next episode we'll go through and do the uh the I guess the gate itself, the the portcullis. And um I have to figure out something for the Xbox cuz I I don't know yet what I'm going to do for that. But I should have something because I'm finished with my exam, so I don't have to worry about tests or anything. Oh, I did forget. I forgot these. Right here. Bring these up, um... Two blocks higher than these. I guess, is it is it the same as that? No, it's different. But yeah. So two blocks, two blocks higher than these. And, uh, you can leave it like that if you want, or throw in... Uh, a cobblestone wall. Like that, but that's for, that's finished tower. Um, we also need to put in the uh, fences right here. I forgot that. Thought I already did that. I guess not. But yeah, that's that's the tower. Um, hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. I hope it wasn't too confusing. I don't think it was that that bad for this tower. Thing. There we go. Okay, now I, now I can talk. <laughs> so, I hope you guys enjoyed the tutorial. Um, don't forget to leave a comment, a rating, subscribe, and uh, I'll see you guys next time when we do the gate. And if we have time, we'll move on to the other type of tower or find other spots for these because we can put some more on some other places, like right there, maybe. But. I'll see you guys next time. <laughs> Thanks for watching.